Hey, this is Evil Film we're two back with more um, Dark Chronicles. This is part five and will be the final part of chapter one. Okay, before we continue, last time I left you with an, an edited version of cutting lots of pictures. There is a few pictures that we didn't get though. Um, I kind of just forgot about them. I believe. Manhole, that was one of them. Um, and the other two are both in here, I believe. There's a phonogram, you know, a phonograph even, and a refrigerator. I completely forgot about these. Okay, it's... Oh, there, yeah. That. And... Yeah. Okay, so... There are all the pictures you can take. Currently... Uh, move. Okay. Now there is supposed to be um, 81. Of course, there's something of a Blackstone. What's it called? Blackstone one, but um, that's taking a picture of a train. And because the train's already left, we can't take it just yet. Uh, but we, d we can take it there on, so. Yeah. Um, as for now, we're heading back to do the final dungeon room, which isn't actually a dungeon in itself. It's just some random thing. We'll, we'll get into inventions from chapter 2 onwards. For now, we're just focusing on finishing this chapter off. So I'm assuming this is going to be another short part. Okay. So chapter 1 is very short. It's quite an easy short chapter. Nothing too difficult. Uh, let me just say my progress first of all. Okay, there are four pictures you can take in this um, section. Um, they are Iron Bridge, Waterfall, Firehouse and Coal. So, let's go. We need to try and take all these four pictures. There are a total, total of 85 um, photos you can get, or ideas, in Chapter 1. We've got 80 so far. I think. Yeah, there's only five altogether. Oh boy. Sis. How slow is he walking? Okay, I get the picture. Oh boy, look at this. Wow. What beautifulness. Right here. And the crazy music. Making everything dramatic. Okay. Anything down here we can take pictures of. Yeah, um Waterfall. It's the first of the four. Um what's the river three? Coal, a firehouse, and iron bridge. Oh, anything over here? No. Iron bridge. No. And iron bridge. Where the hell is this? Go to. Where's coal? I don't want to miss it. Where is coal? Firehouse, where is it? That's Iron Bridge again. Okay. I don't wanna. Anything? No, it's nothing. Well, there must be somewhere, so. Anything over here? No, wait. We're gonna go straight into something. What's happening? That was the first time I had seen it. The sky that reached so far away, so far above, the most beautiful thing I had ever seen. But I was yet to realize that great changes were happening in the world. Cedric! 
Cedric, what are you doing here? Ha <laughs> ha What you think? You surprised? The Blackstone Railroad's back and ready for action. We're gonna see the world on this baby. Max, we got quite an adventure ahead of us. Hop on so we can hit the road. All right, listen up, Max. This is what I found out from Need. His story was pretty far-fetched. It was 15 years ago. Something, Something terrible happened in the world. What exactly happened? You don't need this letter to tell you that, do you, Mother? Listening to Cedric's story, at first I was surprised. But as I listened, I slowly started to understand exactly what it was that was happening around me. 15 years ago, the world was laid to waste, and all that remained was the town of Palm Brinks. Our enemy, the one who destroyed everything, was a mysterious ruler. His name? Emperor Griffin. We still don't know why he did this, why he destroyed our world. The reason that he did not also destroy Palm Brinks was because of a stone he believed was hidden in our town. Yes, the stone I'm wearing right now. Griffin's henchman, Flotsam, threatened the mayor and made him search for the stone. And that's why, when he found out that I had it, he wanted to catch me so badly. The world laid to waste, the elusive overlord Emperor Griffin, and the strange stone that everyone seemed to want. With this mysterious puzzle, my adventure began. What the? It came from outside! Max, that ladder there leads to the roof of the train. Go check it out. Gotcha. There's probably going to be in here. Yeah, that's fire house. So where's the coal? No. Where is the coal? Look there. Okay, I believe that's every picture taken now. Nope. Um Yes. Eighty four, eighty-five. Ooh. Okay, so we've got one picture left to take, which is of this place in general. We can't take that just yet. But I think we should better take it in this part. Okay. What's up here? Another ball. Take a mini boss. And ooh, we took some of his life away. No, oh, miss. Don't play, miss. Come on, grab a bomb. Oops. Ah, oh, failed. Come on. Oh, 
Come on. Oh, nothing again. Grab that. No, oh, I missed again. Oh, my health is rubbish. Um, I did nothing. Why are we? Come on. No, oh, I'm blowing him up. No, oh. you're failing here. Crap. No, no, what are we doing? This place is gonna be destroyed. Oh, we failed. No. Um. It's no good, man. Yes. Can we try again? Try again, yes. Nicole, you can just try again. Ha! Okay, quickly. Come on! Ooh! Two hits already! Come on, we can do it this time! Can pop already! No, missed! Come on! Pick up the fort! Ooh! Beat him! Yay! Second time round. Very quickly actually that time round. It's, it's on fire! Do something you worthless luck! Why yay yoda! This doesn't look good, Max. He's gonna blow himself up along with this whole train. What? <laughs> Lob another one of those bombs at me! Come on now! Do it! Oh no. Hey, mister! Don't you ever give up? You're starting to look pretty pathetic. What's this? Another little brat? Oh, I see. So you want to die too? Hmm? Sure, why not? Let's go, punk. It's time to burn. What, what, what's this? You! How did you... So that was how I met Monica. Even though it was the first time we'd met, I felt like I'd known her for a long time. Eventually, in the middle of the forest, the train couldn't go any further. Ah, uh, stop by a rock. Gonna take some work to move that one. That's fine with me. I've got things to do here. This place is the spirit forest, Sindane. But it's different than in my time. Monica came from the future. She came to this time to do something very important. That's what she told me. Normal 
family, you wouldn't believe time travel was possible. It's crazy, but this was only the beginning of our unbelievable adventure. The real surprises were still ahead of us. If we could restore the Great Elder's origin point, he could tell us who Griffin really is. The origin point? Yes, an origin point is where something begins. Like a flower, you first have to plant the seed in the soil before it will bloom. In that case, the action of planting the seed is the origin point of the flower. In that way, the flower is the history that springs from the origin point. In the same way, all things that happen in the future have their origin point in the past. But if that origin point is changed, the results can be terrible. And that's what Griffin has done. Griffin has sent his henchmen to this time, altering the origin points of my time. And now he is rewriting history as he sees fit. In my time, this forest was where the Elder of the Spirits, Jurak, lived. He was very wise and powerful. His great power purified the forest and gave vitality to all the living things in it. But Griffin erased Jurak from existence. And not only Jurak, all those with the power to challenge Griffin are being erased from existence too. I don't think he'll stop until he's wiped out the entire world. So, someone has to stop him. Even now, my comrades are fighting Griffin in the future. And Max, I need you to help us. Huh? Me? Yes, you have to. Uh... Okay, I'll do it. All right, I knew you would. Guess we're a team now, right? And with that, Monica joined my adventure. An adventure to take back the true past, the true history that had been stolen by Emperor Griffin. Chapter 2 Resurrection of the Great Elder Let's start with Sindane. Sindane? Max, you go on without me. I'll just stay here and work on getting Blackstone running again. If you need my help, just holler. Hey, Max, we're gonna have to work hard to shift this boulder. Bring back anything good you find in the forest. Make sure you let us know if you need a hand. Okay, take care of yourself, Max. And you too, little girly pie. You bet! Okay, let's go! You can now use a train to move around, choose leave from the train door menu. Yeah. Okay, so now we should at least be able to take a picture of this. Yes, we're back to stone one! All pictures from chapter one are now officially taken. So... Yes! All 85 pictures are done. And yes, um, now we find somewhere to save to end this part. Is there really anywhere to save? Yeah, there's somewhere to save. So we're going to go and save and then I'll wait for this part. Next time on part 6 we'll begin chapter 2. This is such a fun game. But it's gonna be quite hard to do the percent with it, but I'll try I'll try. Okay. So there we go. I'll just leave it here. Max is now Wait. Max can turn into Monica now. Yay! And um, Monica can turn to Maximilian. How do you turn into a big thing? 
I don't remember. Oh well, we'll, we'll figure that out next time. Okay, um, until then. Bye bye!